Okay, so good evening, good morning, good afternoon. Hope everybody's doing all right. Having a Merry Christmas and all that holiday stuff that you do, putting up your trees, and setting out your lights, and watching Santa come down the come down the the chimney. But um, um, so I hope everything's hope everybody's staying safe these days. So I think that I'm going to attempt to look at a rise or a riser diagram. That's the plan anyway. So um, let's um, this is my overall this is my overall uh, spinning a lot. It's my overall. So I think that what I need to do is go to a plot plan. Let's go to this. This is the plot plan one fourth. But and maybe a sheet. Maybe I can get to a sheet. Um. Uh. So yeah. Um. So I'm, let's. Um, so. The riser diagram. What I want to do is look at a riser diagram for the south part, the middle part of this bathroom uh, layout, and the northern part of this um, bathroom layout. Okay. So um, the plan is to do a look at a what do you call these things? A call out, right? So I want to call out, call out a rectangle. And I want to isolate those three areas so that I can make a. Man, that doesn't look too. I can't see that. Uh, okay. So when that happens, I think that I think I know what's going on. Uh, was I think I need to go here and. Maybe black screen. I think I'm going to turn this to a black screen. This one. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that looks a little better. Um, okay, so. And now what I need to do is. Um, I need to, I need to, I need to, I need to put. I need to put a note or a call out tag on this on my uh on my area that I've designated okay uh and I think that if I select this guy go to edit type and the call out tag is what it is it's a call out tag and we go I'm going to left click here I think it's going to be off yeah, it's saying none, but what I want to do is put the call out head on that on my area that I'm designating, which is yeah, that came up. Man, I still don't like that. Just can't see it. Um let's see. Let me, let me, I'm going to pause. Did I resume? Is that? Okay. 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 Um, let's see. I think, man, see, I'm already going off. <laughs> what I wanted to do was do a, is that white? I don't know if I want white. I think this is black because that looks a little bit blue. I think that looks better. I think that looks better. Okay, so that's that. And what this does is creates another view. And yeah, right, these are our views. And this is the call out for this is the this is the name of the view that I just created. And I'm going to right click and rename this guy. And I'm going to call it a riser. Let's call it riser. 
riser um, uh, well, south okay let's call it riser south and say okay to that I'm gonna let's go here riser south okay so that's that riser south um what I need to do let's put it on a sheet I'm gonna put it on a sheet put it on a sheet um this guy double click uh oh so that one's full um let's bring in a new sheet and it is I think I'm using no stamp so let's, that's a new sheet and let's go back up and this guy let's drag it on somewhere on it okay ooh okay um let's see what scale is that overall I don't want the overall I don't want the waste yeah okay um let's go back a C C C I can change that to B can I C sheet number B let's change it to B man I'm I, I think that I'm gonna just go right to um right to the right to the riser I think because this is this is getting too involved because that has to go there oops I don't know what happened here can I move it uh, okay and let's just put that there move this guy over here uh, okay let's go back Revit is very picky 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 Okay, let's go down over here and I think that can I grab this now move this guy right about maybe about right there okay go here move this guy over there and up 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 that's good so somehow that's gonna you can you know play with that put the notes on it um, but what I want to do, let's go back um, and let's go here because because otherwise I'm gonna I'm gonna get I'm gonna get off track to what I want to do. Um, so this is a section uh, that was created a duplicate. We can duplicate these, right? So I'm gonna duplicate another. Right click and duplicate uh, that view so that I can create my um, riser and rename this guy to you know what I can do I think I'm gonna go, go down here rename rename uh, here control C go back up highlight rename and control control V and we can we can leave that 3d large northeast waste riser south okay so that's that so what we can do is go am i there yeah i'm there so here um we go to the cube and orient to view orient to view floor plan and it is level one yeah level one level one northeast waste riser south that's the one i want okay so we do that we do that okay we look at this um let's go here i think i need to turn off let's turn off some of the um models and uh I think that no they're in view 
they are in view that's too much let's go back um so just let's see I, I think it might be a filter it's probably a filter let's go to filters let's turn those on <laughs> oh my god what this is just you just you just you keep practicing keep practicing keep practicing keep practicing okay so because otherwise it's a very slippery slope or some might call a rabbit hole that you can get down into so that's too much um so that's that you can let's okay so this i think i want to change to medium maybe yeah medium is good uh i don't yeah i think that that's okay that's okay i guess hidden okay that's fine okay 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 so that's one eighth let's change that to a fourth and change the scale to one fourth okay so that's that that looks good oh do we make i'm gonna move it up just no i think that that might be okay um and so from here what you can do when you want to um uh, add your text on here you have to lock restore save orientation and lock the view let's go back i'm gonna go back let's go back unlock view um and if i want to annotate orientation of 3d view must be locked before you can add tags or keynotes what if I want to add just a text? I know I'm getting off. Yeah, it looks I can add a text to it, huh? So, huh? And then can I add a? I can add a, a arrow, but that's not a tag. I I don't want the text. Text is just for continuation C, right? I do want the tag, but in order for me to put a tag on it or a keynote on it I need to lock it I need to lock it lock lock save orientation and lock so it's locked now I can put a tag on it square feet leader do I want the leader no yes I want a leader But that is not the right tag. Okay. So again, so just keep practicing. I think I know what the problem is here. But so here's a so when you see something like that, I know that it's not I don't want this. So I need to go to my annotation tag tag and load tags and symbols. Okay, so we go down, 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 down. These are all of the tags that you can assign as a default. And it looks like the roof drain is my default on my pipe and placeholders. But I don't want that. So I'm going to change that to my size system. Size and system, it looks like. Say okay to that. And that did not change that did not change tag okay so I don't know why they didn't change well Revit can do everything huh okay I think man I'm, I'm, let's do this okay so here's the tag um can do this do this can do that um, and then you go about you know moving this guy around whatever floats your boat all right you can leave it like that or you can not use a leader which is probably gonna be better i like that better anyway let me erase this guy uh oh that's not good i didn't want that nope 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 can we erase without going to the family man no can we erase without going to the family? Okay. So we can do that. Uh, annotate 
annotate, annotate, tag, no leader. Yeah, okay, we do that. One and a half. We can come here and do that. There's our laboratory. That's the floor drain. Um, okay, that's fine. So we can tag our um, <coughs> plumbing fixtures. What's another one I can do? This is some PVC. We can go here. <coughs> okay, we can go there. Little little water never hurt nobody. Okay. So um so that's that. That's that. Let me stay on script here. Stay on script. So I'm gonna go back to the <clears throat> to my sheet and drag that um view. Where is it? I think it's this one. Drag the view. Oh, let's drag it, drag, drag, just drag it. Okay. It's there. So it's it's here somewhere. <laughs> okay, so it's there. Um so that's that. Um and I'm gonna use my arrow key just to bring it down a little bit and um somehow get the title. The title's right there. Okay. And click here so that I can get my nodes up and drag the node from right to left. Okay. So that's um <clears throat> So that's that's your um, uh, riser that you have. Um, so you can go through this process. I think it's this large one. Yeah, you go through this process, and the next one would be um, these these battery of uh, uh, plumbing fixtures. I think that I can go to the second level. I think I can go to the second level. Yeah, there's a second level. So that's the second level. Um, and we can, you know, you can put, you can use, do this, you know, for all of your, you can tag all of these. But when you get ready to tag it, make sure that that your, your layout is the way you want it. Okay? Because if you, if you go back and unlock your view, and you rotate in any way this guy like let's say i rotate it that way just a little bit maybe three degrees or five degrees right and you lock it back up okay save orientation and lock view lock the new or yeah yes 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 what happened to the notes the notes are gone seriously the notes are gone <laughs> okay the notes are gone are you serious let's go back so if you just make you so uh, that okay um so are you serious so when you get ready to tag your riser just make sure that let's see what if what if i unlock what if i unlock well no i'm gonna maybe on another video so let's go back to the uh sheet so that's the sheet that's our sheet right and we can uh let's go here i don't know can, we, can i need to move it down can i move it down yeah move it down and just you know, place it on your sheet to whatever. And let's, let me see if I can get a, like a, a print of this, just to see how it looks when I get ready to plot it. Um, and that is going to be here and print. So print preview, uh, print settings, the session, close. I don't know why I said that. Um, visible portion. 
and let's set it up make sure this that it's not in color okay black and white everything looks good or however your settings are you know at your office and I'm going to say okay to that and I'm going to preview this visible portion let's just take a look okay so that's not bad that's not bad so you can put in your I don't I think I can get in a little closer because I want to get in just a little closer let's try this again let's try it again try okay so it didn't give me that do I really want to do this and preview let's preview okay so that kind of looks cool so however you put put it on your sheet that's what that's what your rise is going to look like and of course yours is going to have more notes on it than mine but just to give you an idea of how you can create a riser diagram using Revit um, 3d riser diagram and usually they are flat or however however you want to um, let's close this however you want to to uh, show the contractor you know how things are going this is that's just one way of creating a riser diagram okay let's see what have we got here okay 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 well I think I'm gonna stop here and um, I hope that helped and I will talk to you guys later Merry Christmas to you.